Hey everybody, the Bonga is back. Welcome to part 16 of Let's Play Dynasty Warriors 5, brought to you by GameAnyone.com. Alright, I said I was going to do yet another campaign, but it's not either a Shu, Wei, or Wu. I'm going to be heading over to the other forces, and the only officer I haven't finished a campaign as in the other forces would be Zhu Rong of the Nanmon. Now, I wanted to do the Nanmon campaign as Mong Wu, but in order to unlock Zhu Rong, you have to defeat Mong Wu's campaign. In order to get Mong Wu unlocked, you have to beat both Zhuge Liang and Lu Xun's campaign, I believe. So, let's get started. It is weird that this is the only character I've, uh, I'm doing a campaign as in Dynasty Warriors 5, one that I already did in Dynasty Warriors 4. My name is Zhu Rong. I am a descendant of the Goddess of Fire. Lately I have heard rumors that the people to the north are planning on invading our land of Nanjong. Here in the south we have always had separate kings for each region. There is no way we can join as one and oppose these invaders from the north in such a short amount of time. Dear, this is when you need to stand up for yourself. Be a man. You must strengthen your position and become a great king to lead us all. These guys think they have some sort of right to rule over the lands of Nanjiang. They must plan on stealing our homes from us. Just when we were having some family problems. My dear, if we don't pull together, those invaders from the north will smash us for sure. It's up to us to stand together as a group and defend our beloved homeland. We've little time before the north comes and attacks. I must take over as king and lead Nanjiang to victory! If anybody has a problem with that, come and say it to my face! Alright, so in the Nanmon campaign, you only got four stages to play as instead of five, as what we had in the other campaigns. So I did do like one stage as her, but I never finished her campaign. So right now, she usually starts with a boomerang. But well, we got her second weapon, the Spitfire. So, obviously I'm going to be taking advantage of that right away. I'm going to stick with the uh, Serpent Earrings and Tiger Amulet because this stage does not have playable characters as opponents. And I'll be switching over to the Ice Orb because that would be better for me. Okay, let's go with uh, Chin Liang this time. I've only got like two good officers or three good bodyguards. Alright, in order to win, we had to defeat Wutugu, King Duosi, and King Mulu. And if the main camp is defeated or Mong Wu gets beaten, we lose. Alright, obviously we don't really have a lot of forces of our own. And we'll have to be fighting off these guys. So, let's get started. Lord Meng Huo, it's no use. They won't listen to us. Damn! Now is not the time for all of this! I guess it can't be helped. I'll go and deal with them. Sit up straight. You're going to become great king, you know. Oh, that sounds great! Go get him, sweetie! We'll destroy the base at the enemy's rear. <laughs> Great! I'll stay and guard this place with my life! Alright, so... Main quote, you think you have what it takes to lead us? Alright, so in order to get one of these special items here, called the Tiger Collar, I believe it is, you have to defeat three Beastmasters within one minute of starting the map. And they're usually around here. So let's go look for them. It'll take more than just you to stop me. Now, if I get on the wrong spot, then I'll just try another episode to get him. Oh, there they are. You only need to defeat the Beastmasters themselves. I'll be your opponent. Now, keep in mind, when some of these forces are on elephants, I'll make things a little harder. Because, I mean, as soon as they hit you, you're, you're pretty much just knocked down. Okay, that's one or two Beastmasters I defeated. 
And remember, it's within one minute of starting the map. And the Tiger Collar should be right there, to the very south. Also, these particular enemies are starting to get very annoying. I like Zhu Rong's Muso because it has a nice bit of range. The only problem is you can't really aim it. So it just goes wherever it wants. Huh, I just knocked King Wulu down as well. That'll work. Getting hit by elephants will not. Especially if the same one hits you twice. There. I think we mitigated this threat quite a bit. Oh, still another elephant force. Hmm. Perhaps you've earned our respect after all. I hope so. <laughs> Looks like they're all getting away. Alright, be sure you go back for that uh, tiger collar later on. Now, of course, I already have the item, but I'm just showing you guys how you can unlock it yourself. Of course, let me take care of some matters around here. I'll be sure to get that before I finish the stage. Oh, there is a potion over there, apparently. Okay, I can't really hit forces when I'm on my horse, because my weapon does not have that much range. We can't hit them reliably. Wow. Not bad. We'll be proud to serve you. Her charge attacks are pretty good for like, you know, AOE attacks or like clearing areas around you. All right, let we me keep let going clockwise. Probably a bad idea to leave the main camp undefended. Oh, it's in danger already? Yeah, I better go head back. Let me strike from the middle. Just has stem the flow of troops to make sure they're not getting in our way. Also, that'd be a good time to go get that tiger collar. And if I get the name of the item wrong, at least it'll just tell me. I shall teach you the basics of strategy. Not doing a good job there, Ahui That ought to learn ya. Let me tear through this base. You do not require strategy? First, we snag some rewards. Oh, I thought I was blocking in that way. Battles are not won on strength alone. Excuse me? It's about time I faced a worthy opponent. That ought to learn ya. It's always funny when they taunt you just as while they're actually being defeated. You know, like the game just progresses on its own time. There we go. So far, so good. Showing these savages a thing or two, because we are the savages. Better savages. Alright, I'm just gonna head over this way. I don't think our camp should be in danger much. Then again, there is still an officer over here. It appears the enemy lines are crumbling. If you want my head, come and take it. His last words. Okay, we give in. You're the king, Meng Wo. All right, where exactly is the island? To? I think it's inside the base. We chiefs of the South pledge allegiance to no one. So you northerners have come to attack us, huh? Alright, now we got three we new officers to, to fight. This. First, let's grab the item. Okay, Gao Ding, Yang Kai, and Zhu Bao. They're all in different corners. Alright, I think I'll start from the northwest. Actually, I think I'll just start from the east this time. Because I've already started west. We'll go the other way. There seems to be a lot of enemies over there to the northeast. This music has a pretty good rhythm, I must say. It has like a better non mon campaign than it did in Dynasty Warriors 4, where you're pretty much just going through like the final missions of each kingdom's campaign as them. That's all it was. It didn't really just offer much so to the non mon story. 
So this is to be my final battle. That ought to learn ya. Alright, so that's one down. Let's head for the second one. Right over... Actually, one's in the middle and one's in the northwest. Got it. First, let me take this cash. I'm not really concerned about the item, but I just wanted to get the weapon. It might be better than what I have now. I doubt it, but I've been surprised before. So far, this weapon's amazing. There we go. It's another checkpoint taken. Looks like we're not doing too good in keeping our own checkpoints. They will not get past us so easily. Excuse me. I'll not get past you guys so easily. <laughs> Look what happened. A torrent of knives just cleave right through us. Okay, this must be Gaudang's force. So you must be looking for trouble. You're not exactly the first person I think of for trouble. So this is to be my final battle. That ought to learn ya. Well, as long as I'm getting defense ops, I'm happy with that. It'll make the next few stages a bit Thanks easier. To you, we can get through this. Another cache over here. Alright, last one should be Yonkai. Remind you of our honeymoon? Um, uh, no, not really. Oh, is this the end? That ought to learn ya. So it has come to this. I can't believe the North is attacking us. Meng Huo, I mean Great King, will you not let us join you? What's with all of the formality? We're family after all, right? Long live the Great King! Long live the Great King Meng Huo! And of course, that was an easy victory, a pretty short mission. But this is going to be a short campaign, too. I did it! I've united the lands of Nanjiang, and I defeated the so called governor of Nanjiang, too! Yay, me! Since I am king of Nanjiang, I refuse to let those invaders from the north just do as they please. This land, my men, my wife, I'll protect you all! Alright, so we're not going to get good spoils, but that's how you get the Tiger Collar. Just defeat those three Beastmasters within one minute of starting the stage, and you'll begin a stage accompanied by a Tiger. Not exactly the best support item, but if you really wanted a Tiger that badly, that's how you get it. Alright, so we got ourselves a nice bit of points. And we went up to, like, rank 12. Now I can take three items with me. Alright, I'm definitely going to replace this boomerang. Ooh, the magma wheel! It's a heavy weapon. Yeah, this one's the lowest Spitfire. Bow and speed. Uh, that's good for attack and muso. That's force and attack. I think we'll go replace this one. Definitely don't want that. Yeah, that's garbage. A new body this bodyguard. This bodyguard's gone. Alright, so let's save. I'll stop the video right here, and in the next part, we'll go on to stage two. Goodbye, everyone.